So my well-being tip um, for this video is all about having a little mantra to say to yourself maybe every morning, a couple of times a day, and then if you say it often enough, you start to believe it. So for example, you know, this links to my um, challenge at the end of my video actually. So these are like positivity rocks. So you know, you could make yourself a positivity rock or even just have this saying that you're going to say to yourself all the time. So like say to yourself, you know, I am loved, I am loved, I am loved or I am strong or I am happy. And you know, if, you, if you've got actually something physical to hold and touch and you know, you can start to believe it and you've got to really try and think the I am bit because if you actually start saying the I am, you are, you are that thing, you are happy, you are strong because you are loved. Hi everyone, welcome to this week's session. Um, hope you keep them well at home. And in our session today, as you can see from the back, we are going to start off in our neat and tidy and really calm ourselves and you know be centred. Then our breathing today is shapes. So we've got some shapes on the wall. I'm going to do some shape breathing together. Um, then we've got some sun citations. I'm going to do some citation two. Um, then our game today is spin the wheel game, um, which is lots of fun. And then for our relaxation, I'm going to read um, a nice relaxation story for you. So find your mat or your floor and sit down for me in neat and tidy. So that's just one leg in front of the other. And I just want you to just centre yourself and Imagine someone's pulling you up from a rope on your head and you're sitting and your pointy finger, thumbs on your pointy finger and just give yourself a moment and take a nice deep breath in and a deep breath out. And in yoga we breathe in through our nose and out through our mouth. Just let yourself feel much stiller and breathe in and breathe out. And we're going to kind of, instead of doing our messy little routine that we usually do, we're going to come up to our feet and we're just going to shake it out. Really, really shake any stresses out. Give your legs a good old shake. Really shake them. And then shake your arms and your hands. Just give them a really good shake. Feel them. Feel your feet on the floor. And just be aware of your body. Really shake it. Shake it up high. We're going to do a few breaths called um, elephant breath. Put our hands together and we're going to breathe in through our nose. And then out through our mouth. And just let yourself hang there. And again, breathe in through our nose. And then out through our mouth. And again, in through our nose. And then out through our mouth. So they're really great at getting our stress and anxieties out and just kind of bringing ourselves together, ready to start our yoga practice. So like I said, our main focus for our breathing, even though we just did a breathing, is our shape breathing. So I might move forward so you can see it a bit clearer. So we're gonna start with our square. You can do any shape, you can do a number. I sometimes do a number eight. Um, but we're going to go, it's really good when we're doing our breathing to actually visualise something and try and hold our breath um, in and out for those counts. So if I place that on my knee, maybe like that. So we're going to start here on this corner. And we're going to take a nice deep breath in through our nose. And we try and hold it for that amount of time. And then we breathe out through our mouth. And in through our nose. 
and then out through our mouth. So I'm just going to do the in and out. So now I've explained it. So we're going to do three of these. So let's breathe in. Out. In. And out. Let's see if we can hold it for a little bit longer this time. So you just slower in and out breaths. Breathe in. And out. And in. And out. One more time. In. And out. And in. And out. Fantastic. So that's a really good one to do. And I've also got another shape, which is a heart shape. It's very good for now. Sending out lots of love to all of you and for you to send lots of love out to people as well. So it's just an in and an out using the shape of our heart to visualize. So we start here, we take a nice deep breath in and then out and again in and out and in and out and in and out. And these are great mindful activities because you're being very mindful of and being in the moment of doing this breath and it's so good for you in so many ways. So that's our breathing today. And we're going to move on to our sun salutations. And the way I teach sun salutations is I do and say an action and then you would repeat it um, like a parrot. Um, so when I do it, I'll give you a few seconds to allow you to repeat it after me. And it helps just so that you can remember what's coming next. Um, if you haven't done one of my videos before, if you have a look at Fit Kids, um, or Fit Kids Sheffield, you will see some Citation 1 and some other um, yoga sessions as well, just in case you wanted to do some Citation 1. So, Sun Citation 2. You need a little bit more space than usual, because um, we're going to do a step back. But I'm going to do it front on, facing you, so you can see first of all, and then I'll do some side on, so you can see it from that angle as well. So, hands. Reach the sky. Reach the ground. Ready, steady, go. Dog pose. Woof, woof. Straight as a plank. Caterpillar. Snake pose. Dog pose. Waggy tail. Woof, woof. Ready, steady, go. Reach the ground. Reach the sky. Hands. Whoosh. So, I'm going to do one side on for you. So I'm going to move my mat round. And then you can see it. side on as well. I might move myself back a little bit. So hopefully you can see me. Hands. Reach the sky. Reach the ground. Ready, steady, go. Dog pose. Woof, woof. Straight to the plank. 
bum up, caterpillar, 